Hello, my name is Ralph Waldo Emerson, and I'm a transcendentalist. As a transcendentalist, my job is to spread the word of inner freedom and self-expression. Emerson, he's a revolutionary. He graduated from Harvard, you know, that Unitarian Middle School. He's so brave. He's going against everything he's been taught. You guys are total nutcase. On my first day here, I asked him where the cafeteria was, and he told me to look inside myself for the truth. I didn't even eat lunch that day. I think you're really making a difference. Henry David's one of our best. He's so inspiring. And his book, Walden, Genius. Did you know he spent two years living in a hut next to a pond? He's such a nonconformist. Oh, Thoreau, you rascal. Well then, we'll just discuss any upcoming events. Let's see, uh, Mr. Ripley, any ideas? Well, we can preach individualism again at lunch tomorrow. I'm working on another piece of literature we can circulate. I believe in myself. Bottom line. That's what we're all about here. Finding ourselves. We can't abide by these strict laws. Make your own laws with their minds. Okay, so I'll put down lunchtime public address for tomorrow. Oh, uh, one more note. I'm scheduled to speak at my alma mater next week. It's be one from the ages. Great, you can spread the word of intellectual independence. That's the plan. I'm somewhat nervous though. Yeah, uh, you'll be fine. Yeah, yeah, everything should be okay. Yeah! yeah. Uh, I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> uh, I can't stand those traditionalists. Yeah, the school's gonna be so stagnant. Tell me about it. Everyone in my class is just so glued to their Bibles. I mean, get your head out of your book and go find God yourself. Now, don't worry, guys. Soon enough, we'll turn this school around. Yeah, well, I see everybody was Unitarian. Well, a few weeks ago, I saw a group meditating in the front lobby, so we're slowly getting to these people. Your speeches and my literature, this whole school will become self-reliant, self-confident, and free. Is that Henry David Thoreau? You're supposed to be in detention, young You'll man. You'll never get me! Okay, what the hell? What does Thoreau have that I don't? Sophia's my wife, got it? You guys are married in high school? You're ruining the concept. You don't get what we're doing here? It's a parallel to the real transcendentalist movement. You know, translated to a high school environment? Oh, damn it, man, I thought it was clear! So, uh, see you guys at the meeting tomorrow? Yeah, definitely. What's tomorrow's topic again? It's just slavery. Ah, oh, right, of course. Yeah, we'll be there. Okay. Yeah, so just spread the word. And yeah. Oh, wait, there it is. Oh. Alright, guys, sorry I'm late. I was, just got caught up at the newspaper club, and that murder phone. She's one heck of a gal. She says our first issue of the Transcendentalist paper, The Dial, will be ready to be printed any day now. But enough of that. On to today's agenda. Okay, slavery, options, go. Bad. 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 Okay, well that's out of the way. I'll handle all the details when the time comes. Are you excited for your speech? How is I supposed to know he's that nervous? To be nervous is to be self-aware, and self-awareness is what we constantly seek. It is our score our young friend one step closer to finding the oversoul. Oh, Henry David, you always know what to say. Come on, Wallow, get yourself together. The school's culture can't perform itself. Do you think the silo should go to the left or to the right of this barn? Oh my god, would you shut up about that stupid perfect farm of yours? 
Nobody's seen Waldo and his big speech starts in 10 minutes. Finally. Where were you? Philosophizing. He's a working with genius. Oh my god, this is amazing! I know. It is some thinking. The way we could truly change this school by ourselves is to encourage them to help us with it. Have you read this? He's telling them to create their own writing styles, to break from tradition. This is brilliant. I know, I'm not going to be doing better. Congratulations, this is a great accomplishment. Yeah, I really think I got to them. Damn right you got to them. That's why it's not writing right now. Oh, come on guys, those are all our words. Let's just go home. You're ending it like that? Yeah, why? Well, that's very misleading. I mean, sure, the Transcendentalist movement sparked some new literature, but it was all over within a few years. You can't end it all nice and happy like that. Seriously, the whole high school translation thing was hard enough to follow. What do you guys say about the production of uh, this video? I think it's incredible what we're doing here. Um, Mr. Bachman's 8th period class is going to learn so much. <laughs>